This exercise is gonna be your kettlebell pullover. So start with a light, moderate, heavy kettlebell. And we're going to lay down on our back. And for this, I like to put my feet on top of the bench. And that's gonna help me keep my spine more of a neutral position. Uh, that's mostly because I have short legs. So if my legs are on the ground, my, up, my lower back is gonna have a, a little extra arch. So I'm just gonna position my feet on top of the bench here. <clears throat> Grab your kettlebell in a bottoms up position. Grab it by the horns like this. And then raise it straight up in the air. All right, get your ribs pushed down, keep the core engaged. And then we're gonna pull this kettlebell apart. So I'm gonna actively try and pull the kettlebell apart. That's gonna get your lats engaged, elbows nice and uh, kind of tight here in the center. And then nice and slow, I'm gonna lower down and I'm gonna keep that tension in the last by pulling the kettlebell apart the entire time. Go as far as you comfortably can, kind of feel that stretch, and then really think about the shoulder blades pulling back into your starting position. All right, so the whole time I'm pulling that kettlebell apart and my elbows are not flared out, all right? So try and aim your elbows close together in the center here as we're pulling that kettlebell apart. Go as far as you can, and then use your shoulder blades and arms, shoulders to pull back into that starting position. <laughs> All right, entire time the core is engaged too, so I'm not letting the ribs flare out. So keep the ribs tucked down. 